The Trump administration said Monday it will end a special reprieve from deportation for thousands of Nicaraguans who have been allowed to stay in the U.S. for years, but delayed a decision on similar protections for tens of thousands of Hondurans. The Department of Homeland Security announced that it would not renew temporary protected status for about 5,300 Nicaraguans whose protections under the program expire on January 5. They will be allowed to stay in the U.S. only until January 5, 2019, unless they qualify to stay under other provisions of immigration law, senior administration officials told reporters. But the administration gave a six month reprieve to some 86,000 Hondurans also covered by the program. The officials said that acting Homeland Security Secretary Elaine Duke needed more time to determine if conditions in Honduras had improved enough to allow them to return home. The temporary status program was originally set up to protect immigrants from countries that were badly hurt by hurricanes, earthquakes, and other natural disasters. Many have lived in the U.S. for as much as 20 years, with large numbers in Southern California.